Hey everybody, one of Weezum here. As you can see, we have made a transition to Winterfest Lobster. Uh, he is currently boiled, that's why he's gold. I did not anticipate he would be gold. I planned that he would be red, that's why I wanted to take hard boiled with him. Uh, it was my plan since I got the 3DS version and I knew that there was a Winterfest Lobster and he was going to be red and look like Santa. Uh, hard boiled made perfect sense. And then they threw this into the equation. Uh, a lot of you will probably really like the color change. Uh, I just don't like gold. I think it's cool that they did it and it looks pretty good. But uh, what I have done here, I had an issue when I did Lobstar's base upgrades. Uh, boiling over, it seemed to me, uh, might have been where the uh, releasing of the steam or the star clap as I like to call it went from uh, uh, what was it? Uh, 10 to 15, um, and then it basically becomes, let's see, what is it, uh, da, 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 40 to 60, but what it does now, it actually has jumped to 52 to 78, I'll showcase that to you, again, 52 three times, 78 three times, a mix of the, you know, the three numbers, um, right now he's not boiled. And we're going to do, you know, 10 to 15, three times is our best case scenario. If I come in here, you can see he's got, you know, sharp shot. And uh, I have not bought boiling over. You'll see that in just a little bit. This is his second base upgrade. And now, basically, he's going to do the 52 to 78 three times. It's kind of more of a star clap to me. It's a steam shot. Um, it's actually ranged fairly well. But... Uh, that to me is interesting because sharp shot you would think uh, basically what we have right now is lobstar roll as you can see here it's not the express yet it's just the roll and then we've got the uh, sharp shot which is you know when the stars change and our damage goes up to 33 to 49 um, apparently sharp shot also includes when you boil the releasing of the steam jumps to the 52 to 78, so interesting stuff there. I promised I'd try to figure it out for you, and we did. And so now we're going to continue here. Winterfest, you'll get a little bonus here. Boiling over, uh, this is his third base upgrade, which proves that I do not have it. I only have, as I stated, uh, Lobstar Roll and Sharp Shot. So Sharp Shot is definitively where the s boiled steam release jumps to 52 to 78. So, uh, boiling over, release steam while boiling to repel enemies. Tap B to let off more steam. Um, <clears throat> we'll go ahead and grab this for 774. Basically, you know, and I'm going to try something here because what this does is it's all of that. And I don't know, I mean, like, you would think this is where the 52 to 78 would come in. It actually has already happened with Sharp Shot, so I don't know. <laughs> you know, it just doesn't make sense to me. Uh, we are ready, that's why. Dad gum, I push Nintendo buttons. Uh, it happens a lot. Uh, it's very hard for me to adjust to the different controllers. Uh, Lobstar Express is next. Lobstar roll is faster and knocks away enemies if boiled releases a steam blast afterwards. You know what? I didn't check that. Uh, that steam blast last time. I guess I did do it, but I didn't, I guess, check it, per se. Anyway, we took Shooting Star with Lobstar. I'm very happy with it. I would have loved to have seen a plus 40 armor. I also would have liked to see Superstars, the first one, actually uh, not have to be boiled. And then I would have liked twice the star power to actually be there. And then Superstar to be when you hold and charge it. But the charged attack for five seconds is crazy. Star defense is awesome. Uh, that is a great path, in my opinion. Uh, however, with Winterfest, who I thought was going to stay red. Uh, I thought when he boiled, he'd still be red, and I thought, okay, I'm going to do, you know, hard-boiled with Winterfest because it's color-coordinated. And now he turns gold, but uh, we'll just run with that. Uh, improve boiling temper attacks. We're going to accept that. That way you don't have to sit through another cutscene. But basically, uh, the Lobstar Express, you jump from... Uh, Ah, what were we doing? 50 to 75 and 61, 91. Now standard, we do uh, 65 to 97, but when we're boiled, we do 79 to 118. So let's check that out. Um, I want to try and coordinate this. 
So it does 32. I've got damage number one on Steam now. 32 three times. Okay, let me get that documented. Lobstar Express, uh, 65 to 97, 79 to 118, with 32 to 48 three times Steam at it. I should put end of charge there, actually. So, again, he's a very complicated man to document, this Lobstar and Winter Fest. That said, we're going to get to the good stuff here. That was all just kind of bonus content for you. Uh, we're going to come in, and we're actually going to showcase now the hard-boiled upgrade path. It begins with getting steamed. After getting hit by enemies, automatically really... That doesn't make a lot of sense the way it's worded, but after getting hit by enemies automatically release steam to damage them right back. 1462 with our 7 wing sapphire discount. We'll go ahead and grab that. Can't really showcase this one here. Um, might jump into a level or something for you, try to figure that out. Uh, let's just hop back in because of that. Self E steam. All steam abilities get stronger. Hmm. You know what, I guess we better better go check this out. I think it's actually faster just to go to Chapter 1 than it is to go into Chaos's Doom Challenge. Particularly, um, I guess I should have gone into a different chapter, but I can breeze through this thing. Yeah, we'll just get to Sheep Creep, you have to listen to that, there's sadly no way around it. So, we have to listen to Buzz here, and then skip it. And we'll just hop through here, get him out of my way. Uh, his speed is 70 versus the 60 of Lobstar, but once you've been boiled, you realize, you may not realize how fast he is when he's boiled, but you realize how fast he is when he's boiled when he's not boiled. So, uh, he could actually breeze through here a lot quicker uh, if we had that. I do like his jump, that's why I do it so much. But uh, my apologies, you have to listen to the Sheep Creep cutscene here. But uh, I don't know why they don't really let you skip these. Like an ordinary I've only like battled him but I can I don't know, 200 you times now. <laughs> bad news. Uh, if any of you do the chomp chest money trick, you know, where you get like three rounds of treasure really quick, um, there is actually a chest, right? You can't get to it without battling this goof. Oh, jeez. This is about as bad as a Doom challenge. Still can't skip it. Now we can. So, I don't want to get hit. Uh, right in this area here is where you can actually get a fourth treasure chest. And then it's only a hundred for sheep creep, sadly. But uh, I want to get hit, and I want the damage to be near him so we can see what he does. Oh, he barely took any damage. Okay, wait, is that only while you're boiled or something? It doesn't say you have to be boiled. After getting hit by enemies, automatic release steam to damage them right back. So I assume you have to be because... Let's do it one more time. Well, he is taking damage, and I haven't done anything. I just don't see the damage, I guess. Huh. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's odd, isn't it? Well, wow, he can shoot those corks down here. We may die. I'm not really wanting to kill him. We have to go all the way back. Got to kill him. Um, <laughs> this is a long hike back to Mr. Sheep Creep. <laughs> this was a horrible idea, after all. The problem is, he's taking a lot of damage. I've done absolutely nothing offensive, but I'm not seeing the damage that he's doing. Um, and I'm surprised also that uh, Buzz isn't, like, griping at us. You're like, come back here, Skylander. You gotta finish off Sheep Creep. You should be in Cloudcracker Prison. There, this is, this is amusing. <laughs> okay. We're back in the battle. Let's see. I don't know. He doesn't seem to... I think we can take a little bit more. Let me just steam up here. 
Maybe this will make it more obvious or something? He's way quicker though. Nope, shouldn't have taken that. We may die, I don't really care. Okay, I guess I should kill this cube. That's just something I can't really document well. <laughs> um, so getting steamed kind of sucks, basically. Um, inconclusive. I'm just going to put that. I'll play The reason I went ahead and did this is uh, just I want to get the bounty. Not That's not why I did this, but uh, let's just get back to the academy. This was a waste of time. Reason I did that is I was afraid that, like, say that the getting steam does 8 to 12, and I thought, oh no, if we buy self esteem, it might jump it to, like, you know, 15 to 20 or something crazy. So, uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess we'll just consider that useful, but I, I literally never saw anything aside from the sheep creep damage numbers. Maybe when I edit it, I'll see something. But, uh, I don't know. I mean, I don't want to, like, make a three-hour video to find out that we did four to six, you know. Uh, that said, up next down the hard-boiled path is self-e-steam. All steam abilities get stronger and consume less boiling power. That's why I wish there was, like, a meter, and then you could, like, say, wow, this path is really worth it just because of this, like, Gilgarn's Water Weaver or something, you know. But uh, we'll take it and see what it does. So steam abilities get stronger and consume less boiling power. Now, to me, it's a steam ability when you just let off steam with the B button. And it is for them too, which is fantastic. It's usually not. So that's kind of cool. Selfie steam. Um, I'll just, I hope people know what I mean by boil, but 20 to 30, three times. So that's unsteamed, um, which is cool. Now let's see the stars, they're gonna be the same. Uh, the charge will be the same, 65.97. Let's go ahead and boil, and I want to see if it actually does more with boiling over. Um, yes. So 20 to 70. So boiling over will be 20 to 30. That's while you charge up, of course. Uh, now, let's see what we do. 49 to 73 with the stars. Hmm. 49 to 73 stars. Uh, let's see what the star clap does. Oh, good lord. 78 to 117. I'm going to put star clap because that's what I call it. It's technically releasing steam. But uh, it, it just seems better as star clap to me. So now we actually need to do the charge. 97... I need to get... Ah, I want him to stay put. So we can see what the steam does at the end of that. Alright, let's just do this until we... 32 is still going to be what we get, I guess. Yeah, so oddly enough, that didn't really change. Uh... <laughs> Lobstar Express. It's still 32 to 48. Three times, though. So that's that's odd that that didn't increase, since that's theoretically a steam attack. But uh, I guess maybe it's addressed with this next one. I don't know. So that's actually pretty good. And the weird thing is, the stars are 49 to 78. Talk to Persephone when you learn about upgrades. That is a 78, right? That was 73. No, that's 73. My bad. Um, so the stars are actually the same as shooting stars, superstars. So that's that's somewhat interesting. Okay, I did have 73. What am I looking at? I don't even know. Anyway, let's continue this complicated. Wait, wait, wait. Oh lord, I thought I, I thought I had 711 and I was like, that can't be right. So, final upgrade, full steam ahead, leave a trail of damaging steam behind. They're not showing him in the boiled state. So, 2580, let's grab that and then we'll have to see if the steam does extra damage when we are boiled or if it does no damage when we aren't boiled, etc. Uh, we'll start over here and I'm just gonna... We should have basically two seconds, so let's see. 
Uh, and the steam is not in the path of those guys. Dead gun. So, it, apparently we're not going to be able to document that. <laughs> Go figure, huh? Let's try it boiled before I escape and <laughs> to attempt to showcase it elsewhere. Yeah, we're gonna have to go somewhere again, folks. My apologies. Um, where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Let's try Champion Mountain. I don't know. I just uh, sheep creep went so terribly bad. I don't really want to uh, mess with that again. Good times at Champion Mountain, though. Lots of cool guys. All right. Let's hope we run into some enemies here. Oh, come on. But again, you will appreciate the boiled state just because of the speed, if nothing else. Hey, is there not a stupid key? Is there? Yep. That gun. Okay, all of um, hello? Hmm. Can't really remember. Just need to find two more of those little guys. Or what guys? Hmm. Oh, okay, I remember now. We have to uh, get this stupid Mabu to come fight. So I think we got him. No, yeah, we have to come up there. He come fight, but he doesn't have to get down. So we got oh, that in that job here. The steam trail looks pretty cool, I just wish we knew what it did. Clearly this wasn't a good show. Maybe Chaos' is stupid Doom Challenge is the fastest thing. I don't know. I need to really just go into another round of that. <laughs> Alright. You bet. Now, now let's, let's come out here work. so I can advance to some enemies. Oh. All right. Yep. Yeah. I should probably right. listen to this stuff. I know you can blow that up. I just want enemies. I thought this was the one with the, uh, they're shred knots. Skylanders of the work. life element are stronger in this okay. zone. Here we go. Just run through that steam, boys. That game. Just run through that steam. Run through that steam. 40? Is that what we're gonna call that? Let's come this way, please. Good lord. Yeah, 40 to 60! Thank you! I am so happy right now. Uh, let's see how dumb these enemies are. They'll probably stay down there. Yep. Okay. Oh no, they didn't! Well, let's see how effective that is. The repel works fairly well. I'll make these Mabu fight for themselves. Okay, so no no perks right there. Uh, what I mean by that is no increase in the damage. So, full steam ahead. Uh, that is the steam trail, 40 to 60. Boiled and not boiled. So, uh, now we're down to the Soul Gym. I know what it does. But what I do want to check out is see if I can get Getting Steamed documented. So, I'm just going to let this guy wail on me. Actually, I guess it would be best if I was unsteamed to begin with. That doesn't show damage to that guy at all. Cool. So that's interesting, getting steamed. I don't know if it's doing proportional damage, I wouldn't think that troll would have that much health. We got hit, what, three times? That would be, uh, one, two, Skylanders of the life element are stronger in this zone. So, I'll try that a little bit more, and uh, then we'll call it good. I hate having to go to these extremes to document this stuff, that's why I wish you could just spawn in this. Down the coil would help unlock that big door. Oh, Buzz, just let me progress. You guys, Mabu Defense Force! 
How about building a bridge for our Skylander comrade over here? I bet the Chompy Mage is right inside the mountain. Look okay. it. But even if he's not, still would be kind of cool to go Sheep in Sheep Creep there. did seem to take damage from it, but I never, like, himself. saw the damage. That's what bothers me. No, we can't skip Chompy, that either. So I don't Kid, you. I don't gosh. like bridges either. Don't try to move too much while I blast you. It's go time. <laughs> Nothing in my okay. way. You know what? It's really just a waste of my time doing that. So back to the academy. <laughs> Self esteem. Getting steamed. I, j I don't know. I really. I mean, there was no damage there either. Uh, that you can see anyway. So it's basically. I can't document what they don't show to us. So. <laughs> I think I'm just going to run with that. If while I'm playing around with these guys afterwards, I figure it out, I'll let you know. But right now, I just want to get the Soul Gem, showcase that to you. Winterfest will join Lobstar as a fully upgraded Skylander, and they can go destroy some enemies. Hard Boiled, fully charge up the Boiling Temper Attack to release the Ultimate Steam Blast. Price is 34.40. I probably need to do some more Doom Challenge and probably need to jump into the arena so I can have access to just a bevy of enemies so I can test this stuff without having to waste so much time. Okay, now the Soul Gym is pretty cool. Uh, basically what we're going to do here, <clears throat> we want to boil, so we're going to hold that down. It takes about another second, and then he just goes into this off-screen jump attack that's awesome, so check it out. There's our charge, there's the secondary, and boom. So, pretty cool. But uh, that is that, that is Winterfest Lobstar fully upgraded down the hard-boiled path. I honestly have to say I prefer Shooting Star by a significant margin. Uh, it's odd because getting steamed, uh, I just can't seem to document. If it's fantastic, I think it would have killed the troll and sheep creep quicker than that. Uh, I don't know if it's proportional to the damage. I just I never saw our attack damage. I saw what the enemies were doing to us. Um, <clears throat> Self-esteem. That's actually pretty Press functional. Uh, takes the boil um, up to 20 to 30, boiling over game. jumps to 20 to 30. The weirdest part of it, though, uh, is that the stars went from 49 to 73, or basically 249 to 73, which is what you get with shooting stars uh, past superstars upgrades. So that was interesting. Uh, the star clap, that may be your biggest increase uh, you basically jump from 52 uh, all the way up to 78 to 117 and then the Lobstar Express sadly we got no increase there so uh, really the stars jumping to 49 to 73 and the star clap jumping that high is in my opinion the best thing if you find that you actually you know use the charge attack a lot the steam might actually be a selling point you could basically charge use it as a defensive mechanism and then come in you know and assault your enemies that way but uh, for me personally I think I prefer the star defense shield and the uh, massive damage from twice the star power so this path isn't horrible it's just getting steamed I don't really know how to feel about it because I don't know what it does so that makes me think it's worthless <laughs> and then uh, self-esteem you get big increases with the star clap as I call it letting off steam while you're steam basically this and then of course you get a big increase through the stars themselves which is nice however you're just throwing one at a time so keep that in mind but uh, I still personally I think shooting star is way more simplistic and I think it's actually of a greater functionality uh, in the game so hard boiled not a bad path uh, again the main selling point here Star Clap is huge, but if you find that you love, you know, Lobstar Express and you use it all the time, that is when you would have to sit back and debate which path to take. If you could care less about the Steam Trail, because uh, you don't really use Lobstar Express, you just spam the stars or something, don't take this path. If you love Lobstar Express, I would seriously consider taking this one. I'll probably use it a lot. Uh, the Steam is nice. But uh, it's not something I'd have to have. Uh, as you can see, it doesn't last very long. So, uh, just for example. 
about five second run time there, so that's it. I'm about to lose my voice. Uh, sorry this guy was so hard to document. I do the best I can. But uh, getting steamed, I just I can't seem to figure that one out. And so I assume getting steamed might have increased with self-esteem. You know, but whether that jumped from 4 to 6 all the way up to 8 to 12, or if it went from 20 to 30 all the way up to 30 to 45, I don't know. I, I can't seem to figure that out. I'll play around with it. If I can figure something out, I will update the spreadsheet. Uh, speaking of which, uh, take those links at the top of the video description box. You will be taken to a post dedicated to Lobstar and Winterfest Lobstar. You will see the attack damage. You'll see my personal thoughts and opinions. You'll see path recommendations for player type. Uh, basically everything and more you would want to know about Lobstar, Winterfest, and their respective upgrade paths. If you haven't subscribed to me on YouTube, be sure to do that. You can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, whichever you prefer. Once again, thanks for watching, and uh, I will catch you back here next time.